All right, we're out here on the range. Target's at 100 yards. It's raining, so we only have the trigger cam footage here, which I'm gonna turn on. Okay, so we're getting our view for the trigger cam. Lab radar's out. I just backed this load off a little bit because it was starting to get a little bit of a sticky bolt lift at 31.6, so just backed it down to 31. We're gonna see if it still shoots, and if it shoots good, then we'll go from there. This is my 26-inch six dasher impact uh, 737 action, trigger tech diamond, loophole mark five optics. So 105 hybrid. We're gonna do one shot just to warm the barrel up because it is cold. And uh, then we'll do a five shot group here. As you can see, the uh, dot on the target looks different. I've been playing around with this, uh, cutting it. I've always cut the inside of them out because you get a finer aiming point. But I think with the actual inside being white, it's making it a little easier to see. So. We're gonna try that again today for our actual five shot group, but we'll shoot our cold bore shot here. So yeah, that one, we didn't have anything weird. Our velocity's still up there too, 28.45. So this barrel must have sped up because that's what this was running at 31.6 in the past. Same lot of powder, same lot of primer. So there's nothing changed except for potentially the barrel. All right. Now we'll do our five shot group over there on that funny looking target. Again, we kind of testing out whether I like that better or not too. I think I do. still just a little heavy coming up probably still back off a little bit there too we're still running pretty fast too which is weird because again we're we're 0.6 grains down below what we were shooting before obviously it grouped well which we expected you can see there on our target cam still groups really well let's see what our velocity average was all right so we had 28.54 average with a 4.8 sd and a 12 es so again good numbers but Still want to back this down a little bit more. I want to get it like 2820. So I need to come down just a little bit more. I don't think we're going to have any problems with good groups. Just got to get that velocity tuned in there. So, all right. So we're back out here on the range. I went ahead and downloaded a little bit more 30.7 grains. Um, and we're going to try another five shot group. Now it's late now. It's uh, like later in the day. So I need to shoot another Fowler and then another five shot group here. And it just downpoured too. So there's no wind or anything like that to speak of. So let's go ahead and we'll do a Fowler and then we'll shoot a five shot group. Again, this is 30.7 grains. Trigger cam is on again, because it's just got done raining. All right, now we're closer to the velocity that I wanted to be at. All right, let's go with the five shot group here. That's a little bit better as far as velocity goes. A little heavy bolt lift. I like that a little bit better. Let's see what our average was. All right, we had 28.36 average with a 2 SD and I think a 5 ES. So this looks really good. Uh, obviously, the group looked really good. And we're going to go out and uh, it's probably all we're going to do testing with that bullet then. So we're just going to back the load back a little bit and start to shoot it like that. So hope you guys enjoyed this one. Thanks for subscribing and we'll see you next time.